Hey y'all. <laughs> Welcome back to the pink envelope. Um, mega unboxing happening for April. I am so excited. So, so excited. Cause we have a pretty stellar lineup here. So can I be the first to wish you a happy April? Um, in this mega unboxing, we have nine boxes, maybe even 10, cause a couple of them have more than one box per brand we'll be showing. Because there are so many boxes in this subscription box haul, I'm gonna go quick open the box, show you the product that's inside, talk about quality, the ones that we know really well, we're gonna go through a little quicker than some of these brand new boxes that I need to show a little bit more on just so we can all be on the same page. I will use cards up top to direct you to see past unboxings, so if you see something you like and you wanna dive deep, you can go watch those dedicated unboxings so that you can really get the feel for things. If you're loving what you're seeing, just go down to the description. Those descriptions are life. All details about the boxes you see here, no random facts, no random links. The goal for using that description, at least here at the pink envelope, is so that if you see something you love, you can quickly obtain the information you need to go order it and keep shopping some more. Something that is super cool is we're filling in the spring mode over here and we have quite a few giveaways for these boxes. Uh, OGs, you know how our giveaways work. If you are new around here, let me share with you how we do giveaways. On the boxes that we are giving a box away, I will announce it. At some point, you don't know what point, I will say, and this is a giveaway box. The giveaway graphic will pop up like you see here, and you must like this video, subscribe to my channel, and comment to enter to win that box. Make sure you put the box name. We have a lot of giveaways in this mega unboxing. So we got some mega giveaways going on. So make sure I know which box you're entering for. And each time I'm gonna ask you to do something different in your comments. So that'll also help. To make sure that you do not get caught by spammers and scammers that will inevitably hang out here, I will reply to your comment and will look just like this. I will copy and paste this exact verbiage in the description of the video in another comment and on the YouTube community tab. So you have three other places that you can go check to see if you are really and truly the winner. I only give away one box per box. So I'm not giving away five once upon a book club. So if you see that the comments on everybody's name, not me. And I will never ask you to WhatsApp me. I will never ask you to telegram me. And I will never ask you guys to send me money to get your free winnings. So have to run through that there. Um, what else? must be over the age of 18 and located in the United States so I can ship you your box. Okay, um, let's start, oh, hmm, I know what I wanna start with. So <laughs> these are in no particular order other than maybe they're my personal favorites and I wanna see more on them or maybe they're a brand new box and I'm super intrigued. I've got one that is not a subscription, it's just a product that is standout that I'm about to start trying that I wanted to share with you. I wanna go here first. I am a book nerd, loud and proud book nerd. I love to decorate with books. I love to read books. And this one's semi-new to the Pink Envelope family here. And it's semi-new is one of my favorites. And we already know the sneak peek topic of this box. So it's, it's not a spoiler. In fact, this box is already sold out. But this is the Peter Pan box. If you're new around here, this is Literary Book Club. It is a quarterly book plus gift subscription. It's $74.99 per quarter. They ship in the US and it's $11.95. If you use the coupon code, the pink envelope, you get $5 off your first book club subscription. And Literary Book Club is a luxury classic book subscription box with page numbered gifts to open as you read. Peter Pan is the March quarterly subscription box and it sold out super fast. So if you want to get on the list for the next box, which comes out in June, you must join the wait list on their website. Okay, this is something we learned the hard way. <laughs> you have to save the coupon code. So you're gonna go down to the description to that URL. It's gonna take you to the website. The top it says, join our wait list. You're gonna click that right there and it puts you on the wait list. So when they release 
the June box, they will email you and you get first dibs on ordering the box. But if you want to save the $5, you have to save this coupon, the pink envelope. Of course, it'll be here on the website. It'll be on the coupon code site on my blog, but maybe just sketch it down somewhere um, so you do not lose it. And I am very happy to say, Literary Book Club is a giveaway. This is my first time to do a giveaway with them, you guys, and I'm very excited. So, if you want to enter to win your very own Literary June Book Club box, you must like this video. Let me tell you, we got a lot of giveaways coming, so go ahead and just right now, go down there, hit the thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Once again, so many giveaways coming up. So just go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now and be done with it. And then I want you to comment the Literary Book Club, so I know which box you're entering for, and the name of your all-time favorite book. The book that is just, when you think about it, it brings joy. And I will draw one person to win their very own June box. So this box sold out at unprecedented speed, like super crazy. Um, and we know it's the theme Peter Pan, but I have been avoiding <laughs> any real sneak peeks on this box. So this is gonna be brand new for me. And if you haven't opened your box yet, this will be a spoiler. So this is what the box looks like on top. And you always have like this little guy full of um, paraphernalia and accessories to the book. So, I, is this called a book plate? What's it called when you put your name on here? And I now know that this is Ex Libres, the Latin, my kids can say it because they're actually taking Latin courses, is you put your name on there from the library of. Then we have this gorgeous bookmark that has a quote and the design is from the Peter Pan book. Everything's highly intentional in this box and very beautiful. Do you believe Peter Pan? Hold on. It's been a while since we've done this, so we're gonna do it right now. Sticker Yeti. It's been a while since you guys have seen her. Uh, she's full. Nothing's falling off. Like, the stickers have stayed. We have lost zero stickers. So, let's throw this on real quick, because this is those great, thick, waterproof stickers. Mm, I love it. Okay, the hardest part. Where do I want it to go? I think I'm gonna put it right here where our sheep is, just kind of with the sheep. Here we go, it's official. Literary Book Club is repping on the Sticker Yeti and it looks so good. All the little details on here, such as this, I think is probably one of my favorite parts about this box. I love that it's a classical base. I love classics, but I love the elegance in each of the pieces. It creates a beautiful unboxing experience. Frameable art with a note from the owner. And this is where the unboxing experience comes in. All of these are wrapped gifts and you don't open the gift till you reach the page as designated on the gift. So. This is open when the last page has been read. Once you have all the gifts out, you have at the bottom the book, and then you always have an art right here. And then I don't know if they do this on purpose, but at the bottom of the box is the itemize of everything that's inside. I love that they do that because I never want to read the itemize before experiencing the items. So you can choose to hang on to that and look at it later um, if you want to wait and open all the items so you have that element of surprise. That's what I would do. So look how gorgeous this frameable art is. And then the book is so cute. I love the classic and I love the classic covers, the elegant covers. They're so pretty. This book has a retail value of $25. And so I'm always researching these things because I'm like, well, like, is this book really a retail value of $25? Um, yeah, they are $25 in Barnes and Noble. And even if you go to places like Half Price Books, they're $22 there. So you go a whopping $3 savings if you go there. And then it's a gamble if they even have them in stock. So um, can confirm that these are real retail values. And then let me just kind of blast through a few of these just so you can get an idea of what the gifts look like. 
So page 159, elderberry and goji berry vitamin immunity shots. I don't know if this is like, so 159, and there's like 250 pages. Do we think this is like Lost Boys? Like that ties into the Lost Boys? I feel like at some point somebody gets the sniffles. I'm trying to remember the story from the book perspective, not the movie. Oh my gosh, okay, I always happen to think it's really great when we get a book with the book. So we actually did this time. This book has a retail value of $15. And it's fables, folklore, and ancient stories. I know there's always story time with Nanny Wendy. And so I'm wondering if this is what it ties in. It says open when the last page has been read. So you could totally finish this book and then move into this one. Also, hands down, my, my daughter, my oldest, is going to steal that from me. She is going to love that. And that's the beauty of these boxes. You can share. You can share these things. If you get a gift you know you're not going to use, give it to someone else. Or let's say you get a book, you read it and you're done. Of course, you'll keep the gifts. Pay the book forward to someone else if you don't decorate with it. I save and decorate with it. Page 65, we have tea and a steeper. This is open while you read. And it's another tea, so you can make a tea while you read your book. Rustic Bakery Twinkles Cinnamon Spice Butter Cookies. Oh, we've gotten these before. I can't eat them because they have gluten in them, but I'll say this, we don't have them anymore. I don't know if Jonathan ate them or if the kids ate them, but those went quick. Uh, we pack lunches a lot with the kids, and so they could put three cookies in their lunch as dessert, and these type of cookies really work well for that. Also, we've gotten this stretchy band from them before. I don't exactly know what it is, but if you have daughters, it is really great. I do this with the girls often to get their hair and tied up like this, and then you just tie this in a bow, and it works like an epic hair scrunchie. Oh, well done. And the last item is a coffee mug that says, do you believe? And it's cute. What a great shade of blue. I happen to think this box is a excellent value. We've got $40 in books alone right here. I love the process of the story, the involvement of the story. I love the quality of the products. This is one of the boxes that I officially give a thumbs up. Just make sure if you want to subscribe to that June box, you save the coupon code. So when they email you, you can move quick, subscribe, and save $5. We do have one other book subscription that's going to be showing in this haul. And I'm going to be showing the middle grade edition, those, so it's for teens, preteens, but they have an adult version as well if you want to check it out. I'll mention it more when we get to that unboxing, but it's monthly, so you can do both subscriptions together without being overwhelmed. Okay, box two. Box two is a highly requested box for you guys. Y'all asked for me to get it in, and I have. This is officially my third Project Home DIY. The first two were awesome. Um, it's not a new box. This is a box that has been around. I'm pretty sure I filmed one of my first unboxings with them three, four years ago. It was a while back. And it's beautiful home decor that you get to assemble to match your home. Project Home DIY. And you can make it as complex or as simple as you want. And they have a amazing Facebook group you can join. And on that Facebook group, you can chat with other people, get ideas from other people, trade products, all of these different things, but you do have to be a member to get in. So this is a monthly subscription at $49.99 and they do offer prepaid discounts. So a great under $50 subscription. There is free shipping in the US. If you use code PINKENV30, you get 30% off the first box in your subscription. And Project DIY focuses on quality, one-of-a-kind home decor sent to you with everything you need to complete the project. You can join their exclusive and fun Facebook community once you're a member. And every month, around the first, your project ships with easy-to-follow instructions, both written and in video format. And so if you are someone who, and I'll show you the written in here, that just loves to read through and just kind of follow your own inspiration, your set. If you're someone who's like, you need to be literal with me, there's a video for that and you can do that as well. She really has perfected this game. 
easy to skip, easy to cancel. And the customer service there is superb. And I think any of the boxes that have mastered having quality products that are fun with a great community is where it's at, y'all. It is so fun to have those friends you do these projects with month after month after month. I have no idea what's in here. This is not a spoiler. This is the March box, so everybody has already received their box. If you haven't opened it, well, then this is a spoiler. Before I show you what's inside, I want to say... This is a giveaway box. Project Home DIY is going to give away a box to one of you guys. Like subscribe because we've done those things right if you haven't here we go again like and subscribe and then comment and tell me are you a DIYer who loves to follow your own inspiration just kind of see where it leads you you just kind of follow your own path or are you a DIYer who loves like a solid Pinterest board and you're going to follow it verbatim your color tones, you like instructions, you like them to be clear, you like direction. I'm interested to see which one we have more of. I am definitely a split between the two. There are some times where I'm like, mm -mm, nope, I've got it. It's in my head, I've got it, we're doing it like this. And then there's other times where I'm like, I don't have a single thought in the world. Can somebody please just tell me what to do? So I'm gonna call myself a 50-50. Okay, let's pull out the March project and see what it is. Oh! Here we go, the meat and potatoes. Your life is an occasion, rise to it. You're gonna build your own risers. A wood riser set with, oh, DIY succulent planters. Great, great touch. So, you have everything you need here to construct your shelf and in your first kit, when you sign up down below, you not only get the 30% off, you get a free like art kit inside and it comes with like a sanding block, paint, paint brushes, stain, all of these different things. It's in this bag, get a glue gun. It's like a crazy amount of stuff. And you will use those items to assemble your shelves, stain your shelves, paint your shelves, etc. So here I was thinking these are like, corbels that go on the end of some sort, these are feet. It's like, look. It smells so good. It smells like fresh wood. Okay, voila. You have the shelf. Now you can just kind of take it wherever you want to take it. I'm gonna be real honest. I am super into natural woods right now. So I think it would be really hard for me to do much more than just put the edging on. I don't have my glue gun here, but like I am digging, let's see. So of course this isn't glued in or anything, but I'm like digging this whole concept of the natural wood with the white alone. Like love, 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 love that look. Shelf number two, the trim to go on the shelves. And I'm guessing this is how we get the pieces for our DIY succulent planter. Once again, another thing that my girls are absolutely gonna love doing with me. This has been really great for mommy-daughter date nights. Me and the kids can sit down, we can each work on a part of it, work on it together, or they can each have their own. And we are a succulent-loving family. We have succulents everywhere. So this is gonna be great for the girls. Once again, in particular, my oldest. There we go, everything to build it out. I'm not gonna do these. I know this is gonna be important to Emma to participate in. So here, I mean, seriously, all of the written instructions on what to do, how to do it, everything's there. But on the front is also a QR code. You can scan the QR code and then turn around, hop on the group, chat with others, see what they're doing, watch the video, do this with the group on Facebook, do it by yourself with a glass of tea, just relaxing, or with a friend your mom, your daughter. It's like going to those um, paint things. You, know, you can go to those classes and do the paint, except for it's way cheaper and it's at your own pace, which I'm all about. So Project Home DIY, this is my third box. I always wait till I'm at box number three before I make a final evaluation because it kind of gives me the ability over several months to track quality, to track consistency, to track customer service, and to really kind of lean in and say, do I want to put my stamp of approval on this? And yeah, I love this box. I love the community. I love the owner. This is just one of those that is a great staple and name to hold on to for yourself or for a friend.
So if you're wondering, how do you request a box to be open like Project Home DIY? We have a private Facebook community. So you can go down below in the description and grab that URL and it'll take you over to Facebook and you can join the group. It does have like, I don't know, three group questions you need to answer. So make sure you answer those. I feel like I'm kind of at like a 50-50 of having to push back and be like, hi, the crew agree to the group rules, which basically say, I'm gonna be nice to everyone. Yes, we're going to talk about the good and the bad on subscription boxes that we encounter. Um, and then I'm gonna have fun and share things. It's really a chill group. Actually, it's a phenomenal group. Um, so if you wanna come join over there, you can. I will have a graphic that looks like this. I put it up every single month. And on this post is where you comment and say, hey, I would like to see, put in the name of the box, opened on your YouTube and Crystal and I go through and order those boxes or request them from the brand to be sent over. We do a mix of both. And so you also can hang out. I mean, we've got reviews on there. We share photos of our Project Home DIY or White Home Woods, decorate with me's and all these different fun things. So it's a great community if you wanna head over there. Okay, let's open a brand new to the channel box. This is called Work Babe. Brand new box. If you missed our women in business or best subscription boxes for women who have a career, go up here and watch this video. Uh, this box honestly should have been over in that video. So they, they tie together well, so you can check this out, but definitely go check that other video out. Um, it has a great list of boxes you can gift yourself or gift other women entrepreneurs. But WorkBabe is a quarterly subscription. It's $47.99 and they do offer prepaid discounts. Shipping's only $7 in the US and you can use coupon code PINK15 to get 15% off the first box in a subscription. And WorkBabe box is filled with fun and trendy items for professional women. Each box has six to eight full-size products to help you level up your career. I love boxes like this because I feel like sometimes it can be really lonely when we're sitting here like I am now in a room by myself as if I'm not lonely because we chat all the time. But if you don't have a platform like mine, you could be sitting there all day by yourself with no one to chat with. And so boxes like this can get, bring you into a community while giving you some points to be knowing about, thinking about, challenging you, loving on you, holding your hand, all of those great things. So. Definitely should look for a box that's supporting you. And I am happy to say, WorkBabe box is a giveaway. If you want to enter to win your very own WorkBabe box, you must like and subscribe. And then tell me, since this is a box for women, entrepreneurs, career women, nine to five women, what you love most about your job. Where you're working right now, regardless to if you like the job or not, what is something that is cool about your job, that you enjoy about your job, but you like about your job? Uh, I'll go first. I get to meet and find the coolest products ever. I love the subscription part of the community. I love that I save money. I love that I save time in getting my subscriptions, but I find the most epic products because I'm being introduced to them through these subscriptions. And so that is what I love most about my job, meeting new brands and people. All right, here's what I see on top. That is very cute. Handwritten note from the owner. Thank you so much. Let's dive in. Oh, oh my gosh, it smells really, really good. For those who are scent people, this one is rocking. Oh, okay. I don't know what I expected, but here is what I'm seeing. Oh, I'm moving things all around. On top is a roll on perfume made in Michigan. Let's smell it. Is this what I'm smelling? Something smells amazing. Oh, maybe. I don't know. Let's roll on some perfume. Oh no, I don't think this is what I'm smelling. This has a light, almost vanilla scent to it. I love it. Oh my gosh, I love it. I'm a fan of eye mask. I use these all the time. They're like a hardcore staple in my life. They are just so relaxing. They really do depuff my eyes. So two for two on that. Oh, I think I pulled the lid to something. Oh, here it is. Oh, it's the candle. There is a candle in here. 
Yes, this is what I'm smelling. Pineapple Sunday. <laughs> it smells so good. As soon as, it has a lid. I love candles that have a lid. As soon as spring comes, definitely summer. I am all coconuts and pineapples and tropicals. In fact, by the time typically winter gets here, my husband's like, no more pineapple, no more coconut. I really do love it. Rose Quartz Eye Soother Facial Massaging Tool. Oh, I've seen these. I've never used these. Somebody tell me, have you used these and do they work? I think, here we go again, from a decorating perspective, if you have a bathroom tray and let's say you have things like this on there, they add a great aesthetic. Looking at it now <laughs> on a bathroom tray, it might be misinterpreted as something else. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I've got to go in there and see what's on the bathroom chair. I can tell I'm turning red. It's a facial massager, but yeah, okay. I'm mm -hmm. moving on. It's weighted. It feels so good. It's made of quartz. It's great quality. I feel like it's an eye soother since I love these so much that I would love using this, but speak to me, talk to me. Do they work? What do you think? Should I try to incorporate it? Those of you who are more in the beauty realm. Mixology organic cocktail mixer, two lemon sours, two Cosmos, and two margaritas inside. Yes, please. Anybody notice my shirt? Margaritas made me do it. Margaritas made me have a mega unboxing with nine subscription boxes for the month of April. Very, very cool. There's instructions on how to make the drink as well. We have this book, Wins Happy Hour. Uh, yes, please. Work hard so you can hardly work. I don't follow that saying as much as I follow the saying that is work hard so you can play hard because I love working. So I don't want to hardly work. I want to, I want to work. Retail value at $17. And then there's a productive notepad. We use these a lot here in assigning chores to the kids. Don't know if this one can be kid inclusive. Look at the title on top. So maybe this one goes in mom's desk. We have a pen. This is Lovely Lady on it. Then we have a box. There is a bunch of stuff in here I'm noticing. Oh, cute. A insulated cup with an XOXO on it and it does have a lid. We use the heck out of these things. So look, look where we're at. Wait, like, it's a lot of stuff, y'all. And then, last but not least, is the 15 minute Pamper Me Kit for an instant glow, hair, face, eyes, hand, and foot. Oh shoot, it's sealed. Okay, I don't wanna rip it open yet. So it has a 15 minute hair mask, a 15 minute collagen sheet mask, a 15 minute tea tree mask. Oh, oh yeah, we're opening this. I don't like to open things if I don't think I'm going to fully use them because I donate a lot of the items that I don't use to the nonprofits here in San Antonio to support women and families. And so I like to donate them brand new, um, but this is filled with eye masks and that's one of my love languages is eye mask. So we're busting it open. So yeah, look how many things are in here. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Collagen, hyaluronic acid, tea tree, feet mask, hand mask, hair mask. Love, 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 love. Okay, so if you are looking for a way to pamper yourself, love on yourself, and really kind of just enjoy your job, make sure to check out Work Babe Box. This is my first one, and what I see on the first one, I'm loving. Literally had to pull out the big guns. So while filming those first three boxes, I have a little screen I can see myself in. I just felt like it was, it was the footage was crazy. The lighting was crazy, and I, I just pushed pause went, tried to fix the problem and couldn't. So I had to go get Jonathan. <laughs> and already world difference. Something auto turned on on the camera, auto ISO, I don't know anyways. Anyways, should be so much better from here on. Oh, driving me nuts. I have a brand new box to the channel. Lux Men's Lifestyle Box. I've seen them around a few times in the last year or so, uh, but this is my first box to show. 
It is a quarterly subscription for men. It's $50 and they do offer prepay discounts. Oh, I forgot to look up shipping. I'll look it up and loop back with you and put it in the notes below. But you can use the coupon code PINK for 20% off your first box in a subscription. And Lux is a men's lifestyle subscription that sends four to eight full-size award-winning brands directly to your door each season. You can expect apparel, grooming products, wellness, technology, fitness, fashion, accessories, and more. I am spoiling the Spring Lux box. I also am happy to say that Lux is also a giveaway box. So if you have not already, please go like this video, subscribe to the channel, and then tell me who you would give this box to. Would you give it to your son? Would you give it to your grandpa? Would you give it to your husband, to your dad? You may wanna take a peek at the products inside before making your vote or casting your vote, should I say. But I would love to know who are the men in your life that you're shopping for and that you would look for items like this. Now, my job, my job is to think critically and to be confident enough <laughs> to express that. So, our first unboxing, I don't know what the products are inside, but I know the name of the box is Lux, and this presentation is not Lux. There, I said it. It's just a regular box with no branding, but the boxes I saw online were super chic and branded. And then on top, it is literally like paperwork and product. That's it. Does it bother me necessarily? No, not at all. I mean, I'm fine with this. Do I think it's gonna bother guys if they don't have a super fancy box and a bunch of stuff? No, I actually think my husband would not even notice the difference. But I think with the name of it, I was expecting more. Okay, that aside, we've got paperwork on the products inside. And it looks like even coupons to continue shopping. I do have the Lux postcard and it talks about everything that is inside. We'll look at this in a minute. I just kind of want to dive in. What I'm seeing on top are excellent products thus far. So we said this box is quarterly at 50. We have a full size Method Men body wash in Glacier and Granite. Uh, yes, please. Let's see if it passes the hot guy scent test. Oh yeah, Glacier. That's what it smells like very, very much. Love it, love it, love it. Like, yes, and so what is this? That's body wash and shampoo and conditioner two in one. Somebody knows my husband very well, or maybe it's just all men. It all needs to be in one bottle, end of story. I mean, he may or may not use this. He'll definitely use this. Or he'll use this as an all-in-one, and when it's empty, he'll pull that out and wash his hair with it. It's just the way it goes. So this is also in Glacier and Granite. Love that. Then there is a Verb caffeinated snack bar, chocolate chip banana bread. He will absolutely go for this. He is a snacking guy. He's a photographer. He's on his feet. He works these massively long shifts where he doesn't get to take any type of food, lunch, dinner break. So he always is stashing bars in his bag. So that's on point. And Brickell Men's Products Renewing Face Scrub. Okay, I don't know. I know a lot of guys use face scrub. I don't know that my guy is gonna use face scrub. He is just that lazy. Okay, so let me bounce over here. Okay, so the first thing it says is there is a soft stretch long sleeve shirt. And so of course I was looking around going, there is absolutely not a long sleeve shirt, but then I noticed this. And on the back it says, claim your soft stretch men's long sleeve using the code below. So instead of shipping us the tea, we're gonna hop on this website right here, we're gonna enter this code and our tea's gonna ship. I'll do this right after the video and I'll pop up right here if any crazy weird charges pop up. I'll just a little box explaining if it was easy or not easy on the tea, just so we have something to reference. Uh, retail value, $55 for the tea, so that's this here. Then we have the method, Two-in-one shampoo, retail value $11. Method two-in-one body wash, retail value $8. Verb energy, snack bars, it says there's two. Two, ver two caffeinated snack bars. Are there like two in this package? I only got one, so I don't know if there's two inside here. I do not know. Interesting, and then the Brickell Renewing Face Scrub, retail value $22. And on here it says, 
Visit this link to get your eight item kit while supplies last. And it does say a shipping fee does apply for this particular product. Okay, interesting. I do love this and I have heard of boxes doing this before. Um, not including the product, but including the option to opt into the product and then it's free to you. The value is there in my opinion with these, with these things and the shirt. I think we have a good value. The quality on these products is great. I am here for these brands. Um, just very interesting, which sometimes those initial unboxings when we're getting to know things can be interesting. So hopefully they'll send more boxes. This one just popped up and we can lean into it more because we need ourselves some really great, strong men's lifestyle box. The only one that I absolutely thumbs up and love now is the Balance Co. I can link one of the past unboxings up here. The Balance Co. men's lifestyle box is on point. But if you've seen that one before and it isn't your style, I was kind of hoping this would be a filler. So let's keep an eye on this brand and see what comes from them next because I think we're at a great starting point with them. Okay, let's grab a tried and true, someone we know and love. Entry Envy. It's my one year anniversary. I have been with Entry Envy an entire year. And I'll be honest, I didn't actually know that it had been my entire year, but I got my annual care kit for my first sign I ever ordered from them. And I was like, oh my gosh. That's kind of wild. If you're like, what is Entry Envy? Uh, I have a full dedicated unboxing. Actually, I have two of those. Um, you can watch it up here. It is the coolest product plus subscription that I have seen for front entry front doors. So it is a custom sign that you can put on the front of your house, like with your house numbers, or in the entry of your home with like your name initial. I have an office one that's right up there on my desk. I have the one that's on the pink envelope playhouse, more on that coming soon. And I have one on my front door and then the kids have an indoor entry sign. So just go watch the video so it makes more sense. But once you get your product, as you've seen in these photos, you get a seasonal or monthly refill kit that's based on a theme that you put in there. So the price varies on the type of sign you choose, but it's about $129 for the big full size sign and like $59 for smaller signs. And then it's only $29.99 a month to have your refill kit sent every single month to redecorate your sign with. And I also wanna note the products that she sent are very, very high quality. I have had to throw away maybe one or two items after keeping them outdoors for a month. I just put them into a bin and we've been reusing them and repurposing those items for other projects. So the quality is outstanding. There is free shipping in the US and the price of your stuff varies based on what you're building. I do have two coupon codes for you. Pink 10 gives you $10 off a custom sign with the purchase of a monthly subscription. And Pink 20 gives you $20 off a custom sign with a prepaid annual subscription and two months free. So that is a $60 savings. And you can use the URL down below to check those out. And I am officially opening my first annual care kit. Let's see what it comes with. So it is a brand new block that goes in the front of my sign of the foam that I stick everything in. So we got a fresh styrofoam, a cleansing cloth, dampen and close soft cloth and wipe down your sign. Well, that's fancy and then a knife to wedge out your other foam. I have never had problems. Oh, no, no, no. And then a knife to cut the new phone block as needed for your sign. So there are different size signs. That's why she has this and you can cut it. I am not gonna do it. I have a styrofoam issue in cutting this. Look at, look at the goosebumps. Just talking about this, goosebumps are covering my whole body. I can't imagine. Oh my gosh, the owner of Enter Envy must have to cut these all the time. I've never thought about that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. gives me chills all over thinking about that. Are, does styrofoam give you the creepies? I would love to know if I'm alone in this. Styrofoam gives me the creepies. And so then I have two monthly kits that come in. Here is my first one. It's already on the Pink Envelope Playhouse. It is so cute. I immediately unboxed it and immediately put it up there. So you're getting to see this one live in action on the sign. 
And then my second one is right here. This is the one that goes on the front door. Confession, I did also already put this at the front door because it was so cute. But I re-put it back in here just so I could show you guys the real unboxing. So there's always photos at the top showing you how to use your products. You don't have to follow this. Um, you can do whatever you want. And honestly, now that I've been with her a year, I have my Easter stuff from last year. So I'm gonna double up on my sign and make it super extra in full. And I'm excited about it. But in this one, I have this little combo she made with Easter colors. And you do an intake like questionnaire and you can tell her, I like color, I don't like color. I like holidays, I don't like holidays. And then she custom curates your stuff that goes on your sign for you and she sends out like sometimes as many as 15 different designs. So you won't necessarily be getting exactly what you see in these two. because She's gonna make yours to match your home style profile. Look at this carrot. Isn't that so cute? And then like I was saying, she gives you the styrofoam and literally, once this is in your sign, uh, woo! <laughs> I thought if I did it fast, it wouldn't affect me, but that was wrong. You just stick it in and it stays and you're set. Super easy, super quick. My kids rearrange it, they add their own things to it. So that you don't actually see the styrofoam though, she sends moss, it's in a package, but once again, mine was already on my sign. So, you know, your sign's covering this, you have your moss there. You use these little pins that she gives you to pin down your moss so it won't blow away. And I can say my moss has never blown away. My items has never blown away. Um, and most of them, uh, when I take them down, look exactly like this. So I repurpose them all the time. So if you are looking for a way to spruce up the front of your home, house numbers are just so ho-hum sometimes. You're just like, meh this is the way to go. And if you need to build something bigger than her online website, we'll let you email her. Customer service is outstanding. Her communication is so fast and she'll help you customize and build whether you're building a sign for the front of your home or the sign for a condo where you need to hang it without it hearing it. Maybe you're building a smaller sign for your grandmother who's in assisted living and you need a particular something put on there. Jen can do it all at Entry Envy. Just reach out, she'll get you taken care of. And this is a giveaway. This is actually a phenomenal giveaway. So to enter to win your very own Entry Envy sign plus subscription giveaway, you must like this video, subscribe to the channel, and then tell me, are you, do you like color? or do you like neutrals? So if you were getting this, here we go. I'm gonna toughen it out. We can do it, Sam. Woo! Would you want it to be colorful like this side or would you want it to be more neutrals like this side? I would love to know what your favorites are. I will choose one person to win their very own full custom sign plus a three months subscription, a total value of $220 on this giveaway. I love doing these. Okay, let's do another book. I want you to be able to compare the two book boxes. So this is Once Upon a Book Club, middle grade edition. So this is my daughter Emma's subscription. If you wanna see the adult unboxing, go up here. I have done a dedicated unboxing on the adult version of this same box. They have in the adult section, a young adult and adult. Both of them are great. I highly recommend them both. Thumbs up. This one is my second time to open this box here. I was super impressed with the first one, but really, what does it matter what I think if I give it to my fifth grader and she looks at me like I'm crazy? Well, she didn't. She loved it. She read the book faster than normal and she's a fast reader because she wanted to get to the gifts, but then made her have to reread the book because <laughs> she missed parts to now play with the gifts. She has just been all about it. My third grader, I was like, mom, I want the next one. So I'm hoping I can give her this one. I don't know if it's within her age uh, range. She might be a little young, but I'm gonna see. So thumbs up from the kids on our first box as well. So this is a monthly subscription at $43.99 a month, 
free U.S. shipping, and they do ship internationally. Rates apply. Use code TPE for 10% off your purchase. And Once Upon a Book Club brings books to life by giving you gifts you can open as you read. Gifts are customized to the book so you feel like you're a part of the story. The middle grade is the newest box and is for young readers 7 to 12 years old. This gender neutral box is perfect for young readers. So 7 to 12, my third grader would be able to read this, which is really good to know. Because this is, if it all lines out, this in theory is her box since Big Sis got the last one. So when you open the box, this is what we see inside. There's always this packet on top of information in the adult's box and in the kid's box. Of course, the contents vary greatly between the two. I think in the last box, she got a backpack that was like the her exact favorite color and shape of this super cool backpack that she wanted. And she got um, night vision goggles of some sort that really do work. Anyways, she loved it. She said the book was really great too. So here we have a bookmark. And I noticed on the kids' ones, it's not only a bookmark, but it has a challenge. So this one says, this month's kindness challenge. Teach a friend or family member something about your favorite subject. Oh, she'll have zero problem doing that. We have a book sticker, which is great. I'll explain this book sticker in just a second. And then this is their book. And it talks about how to do everything, QR codes to scan, things for parents here. And then here is the frameable art. But the kids' frameable art is they color it. Like they create the art. And then you go in and frame it, which I thought was another brilliant touch. Um, I don't have her book here, but in our very first box, we got our Once Upon a Book Club book. And as they read these stories, they take these stickers, put them in that little booklet, and fill out all this information. And once they fill up their booklet, they get like a prize, or there's, there's like a whole thing that they can earn more by consistently doing their reading and participating with these things. It is so, so smart, especially for you if your kid is challenge driven, they're gonna love this. My daughter's not challenge driven, but she loves what she calls aesthetic. It's just so aesthetic and it is a phrase she says all the time, but it means it feels good, it has feng shui, it makes sense, there's a process, so she likes it. Also, by the way, we're gonna totally bring that to the pink envelope. When we love something and we think it looks so good, we're gonna say, that's so aesthetic because I just, I, I, I'm vibing with that phrase. Gift for page 29, a gift for page 209. We have the book, The Monster Hypothesis. The hundred years is up and the boring town curse is back. Oh, Emma's not here or I would ask her, I think the last book took place in Boring. The city is named Boring. That would be cool if it's like they build on each other with different storylines. Retail value for the book alone is $17. And there is another gift down here. The Once Upon a Book Club adult box sells out often. Like it goes super fast. Um, they really amped up for the middle grade box. So uh, the last one did sell out. I don't know where this one is. So if you're liking what you're seeing, just run down there right now. Grab that URL and sign up because I just... I don't know where they're at, and then once I release this video, I don't know where they'll end up at. <laughs> so there's your warning with this one. So I'm gonna try to open these as strategically as possible so I can rewrap them for my daughter. So page 209 has an ultimate invisible ink pen. Okay, so if I remember correctly, those see in the dark goggle glasses thing they got in their last box, also has a light they can flicker on on the side and you can read invisible ink when it's on. Isn't that brilliant? Glow in the dark slime, which is also gonna work with those same glasses she got in that last box. So here's this guy. For best results, leave in light for 20 minutes. They're going to love that. I hate slime, but my kids love it. Ooh, kids. Science journal, okay. I Right, it all applies to the book. We have the glow in the dark sign, the glow in the dark pen, a science journal, and it's a science journal they really can complete. 
Might I also add that there is a bunch of pages in this science journal, so they can use it for other things as well, I would assume. Surely there's not that many experiments in here. I love it when you see one more box before I can give it like my real stamp of approval. But I can say quality great. We'll, we'll test the kids again and see what they say, but I'm thinking they're going to give this a thumbs up as well. Next up, let's show, let me show you this guy here. This is not a subscription. This is a product for curly hair. Uh, this is the Dollar Curl Club. Now, despite the name Dollar Curl Club, it isn't a subscription, which is the irony is not lost on me. Uh, it is $38 for all four products I'm about to show you here. The price varies on what you order and your shipping varies on what you order. But uh, everything I've seen has been very affordable on their website. And I do have a link below. When you shop through that link below, you get 15% off all of the products that you purchase through there. And they have a 100% satisfaction guarantee. And all of the products are made in the USA. They're vegan with natural ingredients and they're Curly Girl approved for those of you who like to only use Curly Girl products. I have not tried these yet. I am going to. So basically I'm introducing them to y'all. If you have used them, please comment below and give us some feedback. I am going to put these products to the test on my curls here, which is a 2C3A curl type, low porosity, meaning I can dunk my head in a bucket of water and it'll probably come up still dry, not wet. Yeah, super fun. Um, and then I will loop back. So we have hydrating and detangling commer commercial. <laughs> Conditioner, hydrating and gentle cleansing shampoo, curl defining cream, and leave-in conditioner. I'll be honest, I do not use a lot of curl defining cream. I'm a gel girl. I like a hard cast and then like to scrunch it out, but I'm going to give it a try. I use leave-in conditioner, shampoo and conditioner every single time. So, I will loop back and let you know this is the maintain line. They do have other lines available. I would just go to that link down below and take a peek. Do some shopping if you want. If not, stay tuned. I do empties reviews in some of these monthly hauls. So in one of those empties reviews, I'll be looping back and telling you whether I recommend Dollar Curl Club or not. But for you curly girls, I'm committed to finding some more products that we can try. And I say curly girls. Many of you have husbands and sons that also need curly products. And so this is for you too. And I feel like the more cost efficient for guys, the better. Let's grab a favorite. Vela box. I feel like I haven't showed you Vela in a while and I feel like I should show you Vela because it's such a like staple box. Huge thumbs up. Amazing candle subscription. Um, they have, it's a monthly subscription. They have three different box options, meaning three different sizes of candles starting at only $18 a month. Their, their most expensive one is 38 and they offer prepaid discounts. So those prices come down. It's very, very affordable. Free U.S. shipping and shipping is only $5 to Canada. If you use coupon code PINKENVELOPE50, you get 50% off your first box in a subscription, which is amazing. So every box always has a Spotify playlist on the top, which is super fun. Every candle has one of these bags that it comes in, which those get repurposed in my household all the time because they're like really high quality like canvas bags and stuff. They're really nice. So we have Wax Crescent white tea and ginger with lemon and saffron soy candle. And that's one of the things, their candles are always natural. So you don't have to worry that you're bringing like chemicals and junk into your home. No, no, no. They boast great, all natural candles, all natural wicks, blah, 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 all those things. So this is a 50 hour plus burn time. Um, you do fill out a scent profile. Not everybody gets the same candle. They usually have three options that they choose for you based on your scent profile. So you don't have to worry about like completing surveys or completing like you have to hurry and respond with your pick or else, nah, they'll do it for you. And they pick what matches your favorite scents. So, oh my gosh, this is like, Hold on. Summer. That's, I guess that's the word I would say. The lemon in it, it's summer. I love it. It's not, it's sweet because it's got the lemon, but the saffron brings it back down. It's not real sweet. It's got maybe a touch of floral, but y'all know I do not like rose 
really florally scents, and I do like this one. I mean, I've literally never been sent a candle by them that I don't like ever, and I've had this subscription. I should look. I've had them over a year with them at this point. Yeah, probably so. And uh, one thing I normally don't mention in the video, and I probably should, this is the Vivier, which is the biggest candle subscription. There is a medium one and a small one. So if you don't burn candles very often, or maybe you like have a one bedroom condo, this might, this would be like over a cool, cause I can put this and this works in my kitchen, dining and living, like this one candle. So they do have the three sizes. This is a Vivier, 38 a month. If you don't prepay, if you prepay, it's way cheaper than that. And you know what? Bella Box is gonna give away a Vivier candle box to one of you guys to enter to win your very own large candle sent to you. You must like this video, subscribe to the channel, tell me what scent you love, and tell me what scent you hate. I have told y'all I hate rose. I can't stand rose. And we actually had a subscription recently in our Valentine's haul that sent a rose candle, and I was like, I'm gonna burn it. I'm determined, I'm gonna burn it, nope. Nope, nope, nope. I literally thought I was gonna die. It, I couldn't handle it. Even the kids came in and were like, oh, what is that scent? I was like, oh, I'm so glad my family's on the same page. We just can't do it. So rose is a hard no for me. Um, and pretty much everything else is a yes. I love candles. Music and candles are always happening in my household. Uh, did y'all see my spring decorate with me part one? I literally start that video saying, throw on your tennis shoes, light a candle, and start some great music. We're gonna decorate. And so, in those videos, this is the candle you're seeing. You also always get a gift. So it looks like in this one, I got a travel bag. It's got like a textured, I should know the name of this fabric when I don't, little bag, zipper on top. Let me get the little card. The corduroy, there we go, thank you. Zipper bag, retail value $12, a multi-purpose essential bag. You can use for cosmetic, throw in your purse, travel, throw in a tote, and more. And then our candle is by Wax Crescent, and I got the herbal sweet and spice scent. And you don't have to stick with the same scent. I will email them and be like, time to mix it up. I want to change up my profile. So you can change up your profile to get some new scents in, which is a lot of fun. And then last but not least is the Stranger's Guide, which is their Fellow Traveler Global Box. So we just unboxed this one, what, like two weeks ago-ish, uh, and introduced it for the first time. It's a very nuanced box, I'll be honest about that. If you love wanderlust, travel, seeking, you're gonna like this box. I love the first one, the catalog, uh, the magazine catalog thing. Why do I say catalog all the time? Like. The magazine that came in the box is actually sitting on the coffee table in the living room. I liked it. I've been reading it. It has interesting articles. The kids have been asking great questions. So we kept that out on the table. This is a quarterly subscription. It's $55 and they do offer prepaid discounts. Rates vary on shipping and they ship worldwide. You can use the code PINK15 for 15% off your first box in a subscription. And the Fellow Travelers Club box subscription is for those with global curiosity and wanderlust. Subscribers receive a quarterly box that allow them to engage with the world and learn about different destinations through publication and internationally curated selection of food items and household goods. So we got a bar of soap, a toothpaste, an exfoliating towel, and some antacid in our last box. All really practical use things. Let's see what we got in this one. And for those of you who are interested, Fellow Travelers Club box is a giveaway box. It's our final giveaway of the video. If you want to enter to win your very own box, like and subscribe, like the video, subscribe to the channel. And then comment and tell me the most, the most awesome place you've ever traveled, the coolest place you have ever been. I will draw one name to win their very own box. To answer the question myself, the coolest place I've ever traveled, I don't know. Mm -mm. I think this is such a boring answer because I've been to Europe, I've been all over the States but like true laughter, fun, and just in general sparked curiosity was the Alaskan cruise we took with Jonathan's family and his grandmother. Something about it just sparked joy for me. John caught salmon that were like 
flying through the air with his hands. We've bought fun t-shirts. We went to these tiny little towns. You have no idea why they're even a stop on a cruise. Uh, we drank at like pubs. It was just really cool. Um, I loved our trip to Europe, but I was pregnant in my first trimester, exhausted and sick. So I think that put a damper on it. Our California wine drinking, I was pregnant again and exhausted. So maybe it wasn't that the trip was the problem. It was my poor timing that was a problem. So you tell me your favorite. I want to see everywhere y'all have been. Okay. On top, we have a welcome letter and then we have recipes. Ooh. So this is what's in the box. And then these are recipes right here. This one's on the Amazon. Oh my gosh. So, oh. Oh, am I supposed to have two in here or was that an uh-oh? I have a sneaky suspicion that was an uh-oh that I'm not supposed to have two in here. <laughs> these alone have a retail value of $22 for this guy. And the print quality and everything is amazing on these. And so the Rainforest, the River, the Amazon, my oldest is gonna be so stoked. This is so right up her alley. The photography is amazing. It has stories and articles. And I mean, just throughout, there's just tons of just, I don't know, travel in a magazine, like storytelling in a magazine, basically. If you're a stranger to that place, everything you would wanna know that like captures their story. I think it's really, really cool. And then in here, you have like real products, like stuff if you are walking a back alley or found a market, you would find. These are not well-known big brands. Information about the photographer featured. We have an Ethiopian, Ethiopian spice blend. I do not know how to say the name of it. I wonder if it's spicy. We have spiced candied peanuts. I really, really love candied peanuts. I like them when they have a little heat too. We have a Kewpie mayonnaise. I'm trying to say if I've ever had that. I've probably had it on like at a restaurant, but I don't think we've ever had it here at the house. And then, well, I don't even know. Hold on. This is what this guy's for right here. Hungry's paprika paste. The hot paprika variety of paste that you can cook with. Oh my gosh, do you use Yes, it's in these recipes right here. Okay, that is really, really cool. I'm not a big, like really hot. I think paprika has a good flavor, which is important, right? Hot versus hot with flavor, but Jonathan loves it all. One of the things I did notice between that box and this box is, the products that you get are a mix of full size and sample, and they don't necessarily have to do with your location. They're just cool, random, real use products. We are on box two here. We will open one more box, and then we will give the official thumbs up or thumbs down. I think if you're a wanderlust, travel, seeking, person, this might spark your interest. We did it. That was nine, actually technically 10 boxes worth of a mega subscription unboxing. I'm gonna have to get some water after this. Okay, lots of giveaways to enter. I love giveaways. They make things so much more fun. And I feel like a lot of the time, if you're like trying to decide if you like it and then you can actually experience it, it makes you fall in love with it, which is another reason giveaways are fun. If you loved anything you see here, even if you kind of liked it, but you'd like to see more, make sure you run down to that description. My descriptions are life. I spend literal hours researching and writing those so that they are at your fingertips, one click away, the most important information. Um, and then of course, a lot of the coupon codes are tied down there as well as the URLs that have coupon codes tied into them. So go down there also. The blog has been up and pumping, baby. I've been trying to bring life back into that blog for forever. And just, it was too much of a time suck for me to maintain it well. And Jonathan leaned in, we did a little brainstorming and I'm having so much fun over there. So this video will be in text, much shorter text format over on the blog. If you wanna hop over there, any videos that you've seen, you're like, ah, what was that again? You can hop over there. I'm trying to get better about photos. 
a little bit tricky and a little bit of a time suck, but I want to put photos in there for you guys as well. So more on that coming to the blog as well. If you have a box you want to see me open, make sure you go to that Facebook group and put the request in on the box request form. We pop a new one up for each month so it stays a little more organized. Um, and if you're just wanting to hang with fellow subscription box lovers or maybe you want to order a subscription box but you don't know where to start, that group is great. Also read through the comments on the videos. Y'all are the best. Y'all leave the best comments. Great feedback, great. Uh, like on the last Wantable versus Stitch Fix video, great feedback. Y'all caught an uh, error. I kept saying 25 instead of 20% on one of the things and popped up and wrote in the comments and helped me with that. So I love that you guys are so plugged in and involved in helping us because not every subscription box is for everyone, but there is a subscription box for everyone. And when we come together and showcase these boxes and then share our real user feedback, we're able to help people find subscription boxes that save time, save money, and just make things a lot of fun. I hope that you have an absolutely amazing month of April. And if you subscribe to my channel, I'm going to see you guys later. Bye, y'all.